Hello, this is Randy for MorganLights.com. Thought I'd uh, do a video um, as I swap out this Alpha Pick 16 that I suspect is causing the issues with the Matrix. I'll be installing this brand new Falcon 16 V3 board. Pretty excited about uh, getting this up and running. So uh, I'm going to cut the film for right now and swap these two boards out and then I'll fire back up here when we get ready to install in the matrix. And here's part two. I've got the boards swapped. Not uh, powered it up yet, but I have the V2 port wired to the power supply that's on the same Coro back plate. Here's the alpha fix that I pulled out. And once I install it into the matrix, I'll hook up the V1 power to the second power supply. And we'll uh, fire it up and uh, see what we get. All right. We have applied power on both sides. Haven't done any of the setup yet showing no IP address did just notice port 8 is not lighting up I swapped fuses between 8 and 9 and when I moved the fuse from 8 to 9 it lit up on 9 but the fuse from 9 did not light up on 8 so I don't know if I've got a light that's out or possibly a bad port. I have to do some digging. More to come. And now we have everything hooked up. All of the channels have been brought in, labeled, identified. We're on the network. Got all the configuration set. And uh, time to show you a beautiful thing. The matrix with no flashing, displaying the correct colors, but in a test pattern. The only thing that it changed out was the controller. Same power supplies, same power cords, same pixels. This was indeed a controller problem. I appreciate all the advice I got online. I'm ready to put this thing up and let's get the season started. Thanks for watching and visit us at morganlights.com.